Can we roll Camera joint. Take two. Uh, this is meant to be a welfare video. Could we get a smile? I am smiling. Oh, so you're happy? Ecstatic. Oh, it's pretty difficult to tell. That's just the way we are, Ken. You've seen the shell though, right? Yes, yes, yes. I, I just prefer a more warm, welcoming expression. How's that? That... that's just the same. <sighs> what if I gave the thumbs up? Perfect! Uh, are you doing it? What about a double thumbs up? <sighs> oh. <sighs> In a recent survey, vets said that many sick reptiles die as a result of their illness. Now, as humans, we're not good at reading the signs that reptiles give us. If we could pick these up earlier, then more could be saved. Your reptile can't tell you if they're feeling stressed or ill, but they can show you. For example, in a stressful situation, tortoises are slower to move and they pull their heads further into their shells. These signs might be subtle, but when you look at your animal's behaviour closely, you can begin to understand what they're feeling. Of course, reptiles aren't all the same. Much more work is needed to fully understand the welfare needs of different species. Now, back to Jeff and Ken. Right, I'm out of here. Spring won't watch itself, you know. Uh, what about a dance? At least we'd know you were actually happy. You want me to do a little dance when we're talking about the serious matter of reptile welfare? Uh... Is that another thumbs up? Close. Oh. Oh, cuts, cuts. <laughs> Don't be like Ken.